In this video, I'm gonna show you how to replace the internal transformer on a Hunter controller. I'm Sprinkler Nerd Andy, and you're watching Sprinkler TV. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do is open the controller with the CH751 key. Then we will remove the face panel. Every controller is slightly different. This is the new version of the Pro C, which has the quick disconnect clips. After we remove the face panel, we're also going to remove the ribbon cable to make it easier to access the 24 volt VAC terminal. Then we're going to remove the cover where the 120 power comes in to the junction box at the bottom of the transformer. It simply unscrews and you can pop the cover off revealing the splices underneath. When you pull the wires out, you're gonna notice that they are sort of soldered together. The wire nuts do not come off. So you're going to need to cut the wires off of the splice. And then what you're gonna do is remove the 24 volt VAC terminals. Just pull off the sticker, use the screwdriver. You don't have to back the screws out all the way, just enough to pull the wires out from the terminal. And then we're gonna move on and remove the uh, power cord, which has kind of this uh, quick connect plastic uh, underneath. So just simply unscrew it, free up the wires, pull it out, and then we're gonna move on to the screws that are holding the transformer junction box into the controller. So you gotta remove these in order to pull the whole transformer out, and then it just basically slides right out and then underneath the transformer, there is a locking washer. So you're just gonna unlock, unscrew the locking washer to reveal the transformer. That's really pretty simple. There's not a whole lot uh, of tools that you need, just that screwdriver and you can remove the transformer. And that's it. It's a super simple, easy DIY project. Just please make sure to unplug the transformer so there's no power, I mean the controller. Unplug the controller before you do this. Otherwise, it really couldn't be any easier unless you like drop a screw somewhere, but don't do that. So if we can help you in the future, please reach out by phone, chat, email, text message, and until the next Sprinkler Supply Store overview how to troubleshooting tip, happy sprinkling, and we'll see you on the next video.